Okay, boys and girls, so now it's time to put into practice all the adjectives and sentences that we've been practicing before. So you need to look at the picture and match, depending if it's a thing or uh, people who are doing or who are attending this place, yeah, and the emotion they show. So if we look at picture number one, what is it? A boring a speech, okay? And then you need to say it in a sentence. It's a really boring speech. Why it is and not they are? Because speech is one thing and that singular person, right? Whereas number two is interested guests. The, the focus is on the people, right? So they are really interesting guests. Guests referring to the boys and girls, okay? Then you will need to choose what is the best option for three, four, five, and six, and write the sentence. Don't forget the subject, it is or they are, okay? Now, we turn into the next page and you will need to choose what is the best option. Make sure that you look at the subject, yeah? Or you choose the correct subject based on the adjectives. If they finish in ing or ed. Let's do the example together. This year, the guests are, the guests are people. So, interested or interesting? Interested, okay? Very good. Check number two, number three, and then you will write and complete these sentences based on what you see on the pictures. Like the award ceremony is exciting this year, but you see that the people on the next picture are even more excited. Okay, so it will be just as exciting as next year. Okay, so they keep the level of energy. The same here, the guests. The guests are interested this year and they will be, now it's not ill, it, yeah, but it's they will be just as interested next year. Okay, I give you the last one to think about and you do it by yourself. You can correct this homework as always. In the next lesson, I will attach the answers.